as you guys stare down the field with the bodies lying strewn everywhere, you see at the end a dwarf staring at you. But a dwarf unlike any dwarf you've seen before. The skin is dark colored and the eyes are pale. He smiles. And then you see him literally wave from behind him. And you see two more dwarfs come up from behind him. Under world tongue, Mushinko says, Brokata. And the one drops this metal box on the ground. And then in a flash, they run. Attack. Nope. <laughs> you right. better run. <laughs> and she, you guys are standing there. <laughs> the box is standing there. She can go ahead and pause the battle music. Yeah, standing there. Still calm. You can hear the crackling of the woods from the village burning. Bodies lying in there and you see the box lying there in the distance. Check for traps. <laughs> go do go do it, everyone. Yes. I'd like to check the box for traps. Go up there. Yeah. I'm gonna stand right behind you. Go up there. Oh, don't worry, Cody, I got you. And I'm going to go over here behind this mysterious black box. But seriously, over here. And if we are standing back, yeah. somebody stay out of the blast radius. I'm around the corner of the house there. Eh? Connor walks up and just ex- expecting the nomad that's just, or the cultist that's just stuck to the Isn't wall. Isn't that house on fire yeah. anyway? Yeah. Have we, uh, which way? Just up a little bit. Yeah. Perception? <laughs> Uh, yep. No, investigation. Sorry. Yeah, don't mix that up. Where's that camera? <laughs> Five. All right. So you bent down and you touch the box, and all of a sudden as you touch it, something starts to tick. Back up, back up, back up. Run, run, <laughs> fast, that way, now. As you start, as you turn around start, you literally see a little boy standing there holding a doll in the middle of town. I like it, And you yeah. see more villagers start coming out of what's remaining. They're all staring at you guys. And you hear the ticking in the background. Keep going. Fast, quickly. Well, I'm gonna run up and do as my 12. I have a 17 passive investigation now? Damn. Passive will not work right now. You have to roll. Well, uh, we all make sure I do it, I'll do it. I think do? book it. I don't like things to take. Book, <laughs> book it and tell the people to run, take get cover. away, get away. All right, I'm running, screaming, run. All right, as you guys are running, the villagers are saying, this, "But this is our home." I'm saying take they cover. Were hoping it's, <laughs> going, it's going to go away soon. <laughs> All right, you see a couple of villagers run up towards the box, and they're trying. We have to save the town. No, fuck them. Any yeah, magic hand where you can like? No. Who, who in this? Who in this has a good alignment? I do. I know. I know. You I'm already thinking away. about it. Mine's chaotic. You're, that's still good alignment. You can't run away either. I know. I'm uh, okay with villagers, children. Screw it. I run back. I'm running. Roll for investigation. All right. Uh, seven plus seven, 14. 14. All right. You realize this is it, based off of your studies from Strixhaven's and the wizarding schools. You notice that this is an Eldritch bomb and it will level the entire city unless you guys deactivate it. I picked it up and I'm hightailing it that direction. Oh, oh shit. Oh. <laughs> That's suicide. <laughs> All right. And most they don't even like you. You literally said you pick it up and he's just running. <laughs> I don't know if we can rejuvenate you and blow in half. Take, take, just take the time to examine the box real quick. What's up? What's on the box? Yeah, it's holding it. Does any of my history sh- show me anybody to deactivate? It's just a message. The you do not have the Eve's tool. Throw it. The only way to deactivate the item is utilize the Eve's tool. Let's go, Amos. Yeah, I'm, I'm going back towards you, and I'm really mad right now, but whatever. 
Kramis, stop for a second. Endless, if I walk yeah. you through it, can you DM? Yes. Let's crack this. Literally, Endless starts running back and you just hear him saying, freaking dwarves. <laughs> <laughs> both terrible. <laughs> Did we both need to roll or? Well, no, he just needs to roll. He needs to roll survival. Oh. We're dead. Oh, Who's no. nice play with you guys? Get a one? Yes. All right, that's your first fail. You hear it ticking faster. <laughs> oh. roll, roll again. Roll inside the de- uh, tape. <laughs> Roll inside Mike's thing over there. Which one? Which one? Marker. Survival. Survival. Thirteen. Okay. All right. It slows down the ticking, but it's still ticking. Got to roll again. One success, one failure. Yes. Sixteen. Two successes, one failure. Dead. No. Come on. Keep rolling again. Yes. Woo! Twenty. Dirty. Three successes, one failure. Let's roll it. Nine. Three successes, two failures. That's leaner. Oh. Oh. No, re-roll it. Was leaner. There's a leaner. Uh, ten. Three successes, three failures. We're so this dead. last roll is the deciding oh. factor. I so hate you guys for running back there. <laughs> Yes! 16. <laughs> Alright. You literally you hear it clicking away. You pop it open, you literally see it coming down to the trigger point. You like grab the component and throw it out. Ooh. Son of a bitch! <laughs> you throw you throw the box down on the ground, and you're like, whoo! Endless looks over at you. And falls over. <laughs> and he passes out. He just passes out. Oh, <laughs> at least we did the right thing. <laughs> if I was conscious right now, I'd be really mad at you. <laughs> hey, this is most you've done this entire campaign. You should be proud of yourself. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, 